Um, where to? Going to hibernate. I'm a fucking bear. I don't give a fuck. To a closest blow a bear workshop. C dot. <laughs> Madrina <laughs> store. <laughs> C dot pisses me off because I wish I yeah, thought I of it. You ever like work really hard on a school project this and then like the person who gets up just before you like knocks it out of the park and you're just like yeah. fuck. <laughs> Nobody told me other people were gonna try, and then you were like, they didn't work real hard on a school project, and then doesn't matter who went before you, because you know that you're gonna bad. That was my high school's career. A little known but fun moment at the Last Supper was when Jesus kick flipped over the table, or Judas betrayed Jesus Christ, the Son of God. <laughs> oh, I like that. <laughs> <laughs> that works on a lot of different levels. Like, that was a fun <laughs> moment now that I think about it. <laughs> Damn it. I didn't know about it. This is my favorite answer, and the other answer is way better. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I like that. Did they know? <laughs> oh, you stinky Jesus. <laughs> Did they know it was the Last Supper when they were eating it? No. Oh. Yeah, they thought it was weird yeah. when it said the they, Last Supper on the invitation. They titled it that, yeah. <laughs> Like, that's kind of fucked, isn't it, guys? Wait, but I'm, like, <laughs> seriously, do they? Or did they? <laughs> do they? <laughs> well, are you speaking, do, like, yeah. in biblical terms? Did they know it was the Last Supper? I think, like, Judas knew. <laughs> 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 that's the only right answer there. <laughs> An appropriate song to be playing at a sperm bank. The Thing, or Come On Eileen by Dexy's Midnight Runners. There's yeah. so many. Come on, Eileen. Come, come as you are. Um, come to my window. Come sail away. Dude. Come you sail away was my first one, yeah, but I didn't know if that was good enough. Come on, feel the noise. <laughs> when I come around, good one. Yeah. yeah. Don't oh, come yeah. around here no more. Come all ye faithful. Man, Chance is really good at this. Oh, come, come to Daddy one. Apex. I don't know come if that's a song. I like that one. Come feel the Illinois by Sufjan Stevens. It's a little bit tonally dissonant, but sure. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about jerking off while that was playing. Come together, very true. Yeah. Don't stop me now by Queen. Get out of here! That does not have come in the title. <laughs> Beat it by Michael Jackson. Look, I'll allow it. How do you like pedantry? Pedantry. You know, it's a it's a fun topic. I like I like to you know really harp on minor issues for really long periods of time over the hey, course of you know say like three hours. Here. Yeah. <laughs> That's, that's the whole point of uh, the NLSS, really. Actually, usually the show is slightly longer than three hours. Ooh, sorry. <laughs> Actually, usually at the end of the show, we make some sort of grand sweeping moral message that ultimately redeems our pedantry. No, mm -hmm. I think the bottom line usually ends up being just don't do the holy three. Yeah, right, yeah. don't do the, the holy trinity. The holy trinity, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Which, uh -oh. not to make light of the situation, but having uh -oh. been to the hospital, you know, like 12 times over the past two years, definitely don't do the Holy Trinity. For two reasons. Yeah. One of which is that there's a good chance it'll ruin your life or just kill you. The other one, y'all are clogging the system. Y'all. I mean, not y'all, but the the royal y'all. <laughs> are right, are yeah, clogging the, the royal system up. Royal <laughs> like, I got a stomach ache. I want to see a doctor right now. But everybody's like, oh, I almost died. Can right you now. save my life? And I'm like, dude, come on. Yeah. What is the Holy Trinity? Oh. It's caffeine, marijuana, and alcohol. That's right. Never yep. touch them. Yeah. Never touch them. Do them. But heroin? Not even once. Shoot up, but No! Yeah. no! Shoot up. <laughs> By shoot up, he means <laughs> take in the culture of strong female heroes who Knowledge have examples to lead up to. joke for us to abandon our entire moral cornerstone! <laughs> no? Oh! The only way to truly kill a bedbug is to put it to sleep, put it to sleep. Oh, oh shit! <laughs> Complex what? jinx! So expensive. Wow. Oh. How right, you high both five go for the same joke. How your spouse knows you're having an affair with a clown. You hear a squeak in an interesting place, or your dick tastes funny. Clowns are funny. Clowns. So if you fuck them, your dick tastes... <laughs> oh! Oh, I read this That's backwards. That's actually really clever. You see, clowns are funny. That's far more <laughs> clever. <laughs> Uh, that's far 
You're more clever than I anticipated. A great way to make friends in a steam room is to remove your towel and show them your Gabe Newell tattoo, or to remove your towel and reveal your second towel. <laughs> <laughs> oh, because it's a steam room. It's a steam room. It's a steam room. You know, steam.com, they still can't buy it, though. That dude is not letting up. <laughs> you that domain? Really? Steam.com. No. Check it out. Oh, it's not even loading anymore. That used to be, like, the landing page for that used to be, like, this, this used to be the headquarters for Joe's Steam and Plumbing Emporium. This domain is not for sale. <laughs> Bad excuse no. when trying to return a sports bra. I actually need an eSports bra <laughs> or full of milk. It worked. Didn't we have this prompt and you put this exact answer in I before, I think? It's I think it's conceivable, yeah. The worst place to put potato salad. Your sports bra or right up your ass along with this prompt. It should have been your eSports bra. Yeah, right up your ass along with this prompt. That's the new Quiplash meta, is everybody just insults the the question <laughs> as much as possible. <laughs> the worst thing you could do with your job interview. I don't know, show them this prompt. A weird thing to hear from your grandpa. I wish I had spent more time, keeps on spinning, spinning, spinning. Okay, so it's a uh, Steve yeah. Miller Band reference. Or I wish I had spent more time Something other than this prompt. <laughs> oh, nice. How the view will finally end. Better than this prompt. <laughs> or <laughs> masks removed to reveal cast of Yasu. Every morning I have been waking up with Kiss from a Rose in my head, and I don't know why. It's been like two well, weeks since I've You know, to that's Kiss really Rose. funny you mention that because every morning. There's a halo hanging from the corner of my girlfriend's four-post bed. <laughs> I know it's not mine, but I see if I can use it for the weekend Rob. or one night stand. Yeah. Rob. There used to be a gray and tower on the lone on the sea. All right, Spotify. Let's the cane. The light on the, the dark side of me. Love remains. A drug that's the high, not the, the peer. Oh, the delay but makes you it know so bad. It's so awful. <laughs> <laughs> can we get like a business class line so we can do our songs lined up? You don't want me to sing from the throat. I've already explained to you. <laughs> it just becomes like a Mongolian traditional, like a, <laughs> yeah, it's a yurt soundtrack. <laughs> There used to be a colleague that we had on the show. Oh. He, he ate a chicken <laughs> sami, even though oh, we man. told him no. <laughs> now he lives in his bathroom and ruins his hole. You know, now that your rose is in bloom, a light hits the gloom on the gray. Her rose being in bloom can only mean one thing, right? Oh, yeah. yeah. She's, he loves... Because that's kind of weird girls. to talk about that. Yeah. I mean, I, I mentioned it last time we were talking about Kiss from Rose. This dude's okay, into... I mean, there's nothing wrong with that, but I mean, he's, mm. he's into period sex. Okay. Oh, fuck. Oh, God, I'm listening to a different Seal song now. There are different Seal songs? Apparently, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he's kidding. I actually cannot name another Seal song. Man, I didn't uh, even know Seal was black. <laughs> Just a great comment. <laughs> People of the future will look back and think we're morons for not realizing that we've all overvalued Harambe as a meme or not realizing that Northern Lion actually hates Isaac. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny because it's true. It's it not is. true. I love that game. He loves the money. Catch me on. <laughs> yeah. I gotta give it to you. Your wife is hot. Plus, she married you for love. She loves money. <laughs> hey, oh, hey, what are you gonna do? Hey. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Hey. Northern Lion actually hates Isaac. 69 to 31. Nice. Fitting. A great thing for a parent to say to scare their child's prom date. Yeah, I remember my first kill. Or I bet I fuck her before you do. <laughs> Too far.
<laughs> way too far. <laughs> there's, there's no misinterpreting it at that's all. A, that's a Josh answer if I've ever seen. Yeah, this is an answer from someone who has nothing to lose. <laughs> that is a Josh answer, 100%. I think worse of the people who vote for it than I do for the person who made it, though. It was a Josh answer. And, uh, Nix and Victor and Austin have revealed their true colors here. Great answer. To become a billionaire in mere days, simply record the Binding of Isaac every day, or be educated, lucky, and stay off the internet. Well, now, that's, that's bad advice. Yeah, I don't think that's good advice that at all. That is terrible yeah. advice. Yeah, who would record the Binding of Isaac every day? Right. Nice. Good s <laughs> You're on the ball with the switcheroos. Oh, it's it's all all the today, yeah. <laughs> An odd sequel to the children's book, The Giving Tree. The Sucking Tree or the Federal Income Tax Tree? <laughs> <laughs> Those are both these really are, good. These are great answers. <laughs> Those are both really good. The sucking Tree. <laughs> I, I, God, I'm mad that I had to vote for that one. Uh, I'm mad. But I had like, to. Oh, Oh, that's like the the cruel harshness of reality. No, that wasn't actually a gift. Now you're gonna have to pay that back in gradual installments over the next forty years. <laughs> the worst part about having your human brain living in a robot body, it probably like okay. just sucks, you know. Or you have to find Doctor Wowie. <laughs> oh, well, there's the first Josh answer of the day right there. Oh, oh, I got it. No. Give me time, 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 give me time. I think Ryan turned into Dan all of a sudden right there for a second. Okay, it's a great answer. I cheated for this answer, but it's great. An alternate name for meatloaf. Inferior way to have meat or Michael a day. That's meatloaf. I don't care. Well, if Austin wouldn't have said anything, it wouldn't have got my vote. I didn't know his last name. Instead, it got a quiplash, so thanks, Austin. You're welcome. One of these answers completely blew the other one out of the water. When the stork isn't delivering babies, he making them. When the stork isn't delivering babies, he's making babies, baby. Baby? So, like, the first one, I just feel like the stork is the rock. <laughs> and that's why I voted for it. Real question. Do you guys yeah. think someone's already fucked in space? Yes. Yes. They they flew Ryan's the mom right up there. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they didn't have to fly your mom up there because she's been there for a billion years. You might know her by the name Jupiter. Ooh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> she, she is a that gas giant. That was 30% too She is long. a gas it's giant. Yeah, it's like way too exactly. long. She's a gas giant one. with a big red spot. Yeah. <laughs> where, where, where the fucking happened? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, dude. Okay, Seal's discography is great. Yeah. Here we go. Ready? Yeah. Okay. Opening, like, debut album, self titled Seal. No Seal's problem. Yeah. 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 1994 release, Seal 2. Oh, yeah. The Led Zeppelin <laughs> Seal 2? <laughs> Seal 2. <laughs> album 3. How's got a little more creative? Number 98, or, uh, sorry, year 1998, yes. Human Being. Mm. Okay, yeah. CL3, this time it's personal. Because the first two were named after <laughs> animals. Not right, yeah. And the third one, he's like, just to he's be got, clear, I'm not a seal. <laughs> <laughs> it took three albums for people to catch on. <laughs> well, I mean, this is when whale sounds was making huge waves in the music industry, so. What about pet sounds? Oh, that's 1969. Yeah. If oh, you know what I mean. Way older than I thought. Uh, 2003 went back to his roots, seal 4. Wait, what? Where, where's what? Seal 3? No, there's no Seal 3. You can't do that. <laughs> yeah, you can. You work for Valve? <laughs> nice. Get it? Get That's it. a nerd joke. Get That's it. a nerd joke right yeah. there. Here's where it gets weird. Okay. 2007, 2008, he released two albums. One was called System, one was called Soul. Mm, these, okay. these followed the release of Seal 4 in 2003. Right. Which followed the release of Human Being, aka, you know, presumably Seal Seal Three. Yeah. Seal, Seal Three. three. Right, yeah. So System and Soul would be Seals Five and Six. Right. In 2010, he releases Seal Six Commitments. Oh. Well, you can't play it both ways. So you're telling me Human Beings counts as Seal Three. Yes. But the two albums he came out with only counted as Seal Five. That doesn't make any sense. That's madness. You gotta interview him and find out which one of those two albums he doesn't think is worth being a canonical number sealed album.
We gotta bring him on Roundtable. Oh, Soul was a cover album. That's true. You can't have a cover album be a numbered okay. volume of the encyclopedia. Well, you know what? That, that explains the rest of it then, because the 2011 release was Soul 2, which there we go. And then oh. 2015's album was Seven, which was going to continue the issue were we not to receive that clarification on Soul. So all is right in the world of Seal. The title of an album recorded by a singing goat, Mountain <laughs> Man or Bleep Boxing? Bleep Boxing. <laughs> that's great. Really that's, that's actually amazing. That's, that's a really good one. So, oh God, he's too good. Thank you. How do you beat him? You, you know. bleat him. Way to go, yeah, chat. You almost fucked it up. <laughs> I was going to say, like, that's one of the ones where chat just doesn't get it. And, oh, it's a mountain man. Wow, wow, it did almost get fucked up. How was yeah, that even? Hey, man. Mountain man. <laughs> We're being fully loaded, all I'm saying. A rejected section of the King James Bible, the part where Jesus does a sick, nasty kickflip, or the part where Jesus blew a 3-1 lead to the Cavaliers. Sports <laughs> <laughs> joke! God, that's so good. Oh. I don't even get it, but I think it's funny. The quickest way to rid yourself of a tapeworm. Okay. Anal chopsticks, or send in a glue worm after it. <laughs> the dumbest dance I've ever seen. <laughs> a glue worm? It doesn't make sense. <laughs> Tape has glue on it. <laughs> well, that's sticky. I'm out of there. All right, it's another acronym. Fantastic. Egged. Never take a first date to a cult meeting. Never take a first date to a slop trough. Do you think that restaurant exists? The slop trough? The slop trough. Well, like, just any sort of restaurant that serves food in a slop trough. That'd be, so that'd be a pretty kinky restaurant. Like, you'd probably have to wear a gimp suit to go in there. To no, you wear thing. pig masks. Yeah. And then you stand bent over over a slop trough, and the farmer curses at you while he gives you food. Just oh, yeah. in general, if a, if a restaurant has wordplay in its name, I'm out. <laughs> Like, the restaurant opened up in uh, Vancouver. It's called The Holy Crab. Religious about... undertone. Shame on you. Yeah, that. first off, blasphemy. Secondly, <laughs> <laughs> what, you think you're funny or something? Why don't you just cook the food? <laughs> what about Chick-fil-A? I don't come here to laugh. That's not a... Wait a minute. Oh, my God. My whole life is a lie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but, like, what, is, what does Phil A mean? Isn't it just, like... If they called it Chick-fil-A, F-L-I-E-T... I would be like, yeah, it's well, normal. Well, that was, the meeting was like, guys, we can't just call it Chick-fil-A. It's fucking stupid. Nobody's going to eat here. Oh, well, what if we just, you know, stylized it a little bit? <laughs> yeah. The worst gig for any truck driver would be delivering himself to a human shredding facility or delivering bad news. I was talking about shredding humans to take their gold before. Mmm, yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, I was uh, looking on r slash, they did the math, and apparently you need to kill 359 human beings to actually make uh, a sword out of their blood. Cool. What do you mean a sword out of their blood? Like enough all the iron. iron. Oh, yeah, okay. Enough iron, yeah. How much to make a gold sword out of their blood? Probably a lot more humans. Yeah, it's like, well, that's what makes it worth doing. What yeah. you will bequeath to your enemy upon your death. A freaking sick ass kickflip or my oh, sword yeah. made of 359 humans blood. That's cool as hell, man. I know, right? I don't want to get the humans, humans to get the blood, but like, if that sword existed, that's a cool sword. Right? A sex <laughs> position for ghosts. Tombstone pile driver or J. Smith OTI donut twister no sprinkles boys. <laughs> Dang! <laughs> What does that mean? What does that mean? I don't know, but he got me. There's meta to this. A, Josh is a ghost? There's an. Oh, okay. Oh, that's I see true. Where from. Yeah, yeah, all right. Fair enough. No sprinkles, boys. <laughs> <laughs> Can I yeah. get that with the sprinkles, though? <laughs> what what does that change? I don't know if I want to try it. <laughs> oh my god. I wish I knew what I was looking at here. Just wait until PAX East, you're all gonna get a Boston cream pie. Oh! <laughs> How does Adele come up with those great songs? She writes them on Adele or on her computer, Adele computer. Wow. <laughs> May wow. I remind everybody that I came up with this 
<laughs> months ago, last like time we had this answer. The answer, your answer versus the answer your girl tells you not to worry about. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. You got a 69% quip flash. What the world's most obnoxiously trendy brunch restaurant would be called. 100 Gaga Burger Eggplant Water Spout. Or brunch. <laughs> just... <laughs> It's just brunch without a U. All right, yeah. The worst person who could sing the James Bond theme. Okay. Steve Tyler, or I want to say NL, but mouth is pretty bad. Wow. <laughs> Jeez. Don't Not wrong, wrong which, though. Which Bond theme do you want me to sing? The uh, Bond There's theme. only one Wait. theme. Sky yeah. You want him to do the one that goes... Dun 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 I'll just you know what now you've done that I don't want to hear Steven Tyler do that. Hey, I just put 82 to 18. But anyway, during the Beijing Olympics, you know how they have to throw up a bunch of those like storefronts so that they can get the tourist money? Yeah. There was one there was one storefront that was just called translate server error <laughs> <laughs> it's like they didn't have one english speaking friend not the one guy who like a 69 volts <laughs> you guys want to go uh, eat a translate server error after the show dude Maybe it might be delicious good, good <laughs> servers there to eat Ooh, nice. have you tried their uh, delicious dessert the blue screen of death <laughs> no or perhaps blue cream hey, of death. How yeah. come no? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's uh, that's for the after hours. Have after you tried uh, their delicious entree? Server error five hundred three. A team of trained monkeys has been dispatched to uh, address <laughs> this error. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've reached the end of round two. Uh, you know, I, I can't I can't drive by that place without picking up a nice big tall glass of network air connection not found. <laughs> the thing is, like, as an appetizer, I really like, uh, just to get, not a platter size, but just a plate size DNS not result. <laughs> yeah, no. Because <laughs> if, if you go platter, it's just it's too much. It's too you much. You get filled up. Yeah. yeah. I won't have enough room left for the 404 special. Right Very now. hipster form of birth control. Come inside her, but only ironically, <laughs> or just believe the baby away. What does that mean, just <laughs> believe the baby good. away? You believe you can do anything. Yeah. Exactly, yeah. It's sweet when grandma knits you a scarf. It's really weird when she knits your balls together. It's sweet when grandma knits you a scarf. It's really weird when she knits you crusty socks is gonna be the other answer. Oh, oh no. With no, the, the counter pick. <laughs> oh no! Crendor, you did a counter pick! That's yeah, an advanced yeah. level meta for the quiplash on our show. <laughs> What the inflatable yeah, arm flailing tube man did before working at car dealerships? Played D in It's Always Sunny or worked at Patty's <laughs> Pub in Philadelphia? I can't vote for either one. That's, that's really so good. good. How did they do it? That's, that's actually hilarious. Well, one of them is Rob. Josh definitely. and Rob, yeah, there's no doubt. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's it's gotta be Josh yep. and Rob. Yeah, Rob yeah, and Josh. Yeah. <laughs> Well, well done. No quiplash, and uh, Rob's won by eight votes. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least they split it fairly. Enough. Yeah, that was yeah. a hell of a good both answer. Got points. That's, That's too funny. Oh. You guys mind flooding. Come up with an award-winning movie with this word in its title. Corn. Don't, don't jinx me on this one. Chat, don't even think that I stole the answer from you. I've, you've, look at the screen. I've been in for like 15 seconds. <laughs> oh, so it's gonna be the Maze Runner, huh? Look. <laughs> <laughs> oh, if someone types in tennis, they win. Nah, uh, you think it'll get that many people eight layers deep? I what think tennis? so. What? 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 Ah, uh, it's the oh, Indians call it maze. But what does tennis have to do with anything? Brace yourselves. Oh. Oh. I got a long story to tell you after the stream. No. <laughs> corn, right. corn man, corn harder, the good, the bad, and the corn, the maze runner. Corn, they call it maze. No answer. Corn versus corn, the alt documentary. The Spanish call it maize. Corn, they call it maze, the maze wow. runner. Wow. Oh, the one that wow. didn't even like. That's the game. Listen, I guess. Why do you do explain the joke? 
And the thieves get away with it again. It's like Wall Street all over again. Hey, a maze runner was the best answer. The pander is too strong for that answer. How does Swiss cheese get all those holes? From the cheese gnomes boners, or Nick wanted a midnight snack. Nothing wrong with that. Wait, what? I don't. I don't get it. I don't oh, because he bites into I the bites cheese the... block. Ooh, nice. I bites the cheese. I bites the cheese block. I bites the cheese. <laughs> I bites the cheese. <laughs> oh, yes, I get the hose again. <laughs> Wait, why did you say it like that, though? Why did you? <laughs> I bites the cheese. <laughs> I, I think I bites the cheese. <laughs> <laughs> it's so Jesus, what's the Jesus, precious. Title of an HGTV show for bees. Holy shit, bees run or the Property Brothers who are also bees. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I like that one a lot. <laughs> oh yeah, we got a partner OK Spaghetti with that. that, that. <laughs> <laughs> Property Brothers who are also bees. <laughs> What? I want to do the promos for that show. No, no, the property brothers who are also bees. <laughs> they got into business together. <laughs> All right, bee puns, go. <laughs> the property brothers who are also bees with a quiplash. <laughs> the new show on the block that's creating quite the Dude, buzz. Chance yeah. doing this. Chance like trying to make it better, and it's like I didn't go through it all myself. They're like the proper B brothers. Yeah, okay, that's way more clever and ten times less funny. Yeah, but yeah, the property beethers. People would just look at that and be like, I don't get it. What do you mean the property beethers? <laughs> Okay, hold on. A man just gave me a hundred bits, and he said, "How much milk is an acceptable amount to consume per day?" I do about a gallon per day. That's too much milk. That's a lot of milk. Man. I don't know how much is acceptable, but that is outside of the bounds of normalcy. Let's start with Real that. Is, like, way too high. Realistically, like he's lying, right? Like he can't. You can't possibly do a gallon. That's expensive per day, to do right? a gallon in a day. It's just gonna take you a while. That's a lot of milk. You just can't do it in an hour. That's a, That's a lot of milk. That's a lot of milk. That's a lot of milk. You do about a half gallon a day? How is this common? If I have a glass of milk, I'm shitting my brains out for like four well, hours. Well, you are lactose intolerant. <laughs> well, I'm not exact. I'm like kind of lactose intolerant. If one glass of milk makes you shit your brains out, you are <laughs> lactose intolerant full stop. I might have been using hyperbole. <laughs> Well then, I'm not being pedantic if it's essential to the point you're I making. I never said you were pedantic in that case. That's pedantic. I didn't say that. Whenever uh, I say that's too much milk, and chat goes, what are your bones made out of, you know, sand? Like, you know, big milk already got to you. Give me the undecided <laughs> drinkers. That was my rap name back in the day. <laughs> the one change churches could make that would probably get more people to attend. Hookers or get Niantic to put a ditto in it. Oh, I'll be definitely oh, going to church. <laughs> All the millennials Never these girl. days. Oh, you won't even, won't even go to church yet. unless Pokemon goes there. They say if you're scared, go to church. <laughs> yeah. But remember, he knows the Bible. 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 <laughs> Baby, when I get you, get you, get you, get you. I'm gonna catch a ditto at church. Put it in the Pokedex, Professor Oak to turn it. <laughs> Kind of candy. Picture of Trump's saggy sack. Northern Lion finds sack. Family rejoices. Sack tits. Trump's new sex scandal. Jack Black's sack attacked. Shit's whack. <laughs> Trump gets the sack. Trump sacked for showing his sack. Wow. Well, uh... well, it looks like you guys are all SJW, Red Pill, George Soros, John Tron, Paige Shields now. This is the worst graph I've ever seen for a last slash. Hey, what happened? What happened? Well, I mean, I don't want to brag, but everybody's oh, got oh, like. Oh, <laughs> 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 that is. Yeah, yeah, no, that's pretty intense. I have a perfect NLSS argument that we could start right now. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, are you guys the type of people that eat your meals in compartments, or do you eat it all, all at the same time? All together. Wait, say that all one together. more time. What do you mean by all so together? Like, so, like, like if you have, like, a steak, mashed potatoes, and asparagus, right? 
do you eat just the potatoes, then you eat just the asparagus, and There's... then just the steak, or do you eat all of them, you know, like at the same I time? I will. I will most. I will start with the steak, yes. and sometimes I'll even dip my steak into my mashed That's potatoes. And that that's actually yeah. the worst. Thing ever. No, <laughs> no. And then I'll probably eat the asparagus last. Although I love asparagus. You get a steak. You get either like some caramelized onions or some sautéed mushrooms right on top of that. It really is shit. the perfect NLSS argument. <laughs> oh. Everybody slotted into their roles immediately. <laughs> <laughs> if you Liquid drink snake. wine for any reason but to get drunk, your head is so far up your ass. I what? we have to keep doing this show because it makes me realize that despite <laughs> our militant opinions, we're actually like the most tolerant people on planet Earth. <laughs> it's, this is why there's like an age limit on being the leader of a country. Is if they elected like 22 year olds, it would be like wine's illegal except to get shit faced. <laughs> I'm, no, I'm just telling it like it is. <laughs> why? If you're gonna drink a drink to get shit faced, wine would not be your choice. Mm. Unless it's box wine. A fun activity that only requires three fingers. The shocker LOL, finger in pooper and vag LOL. Or ten pin bowling. <laughs> yep. That's right. such an innocent answer. Yeah. yeah. That's a good one. This is Josh, this is Josh and Bear. Josh and Bear. Yep. <laughs> yeah. And pooper and veg, lol. <laughs> lol. It did make me lol too, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It, it got you. Yeah. Sometimes you just want to put it in the pooper and the veg at the same time. Ten yeah. and bowling wins. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Fifty-two to forty-eight. <laughs> All right. Oh, Josh and Ryan. I, I, I've never been points. more sure that ten pin bowling was a Ryan answer because he's the only one here who wouldn't just put words. bowling. He'd have to put <laughs> ten pin bowling. Well, we, the joke works better with a cadence. A weird dad keeps all of his children's children as memories. Or a weird dad keeps all of his children subtract the apostrophe S as memories. A weird dad keeps all of his children as memories. Okay. <laughs> Did Dan Trojan Horse an answer in this one? <laughs> the weirdest event for which to camp out the night before. Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild release oh, or buying the newest doomed Nintendo console? <laughs> Ooh. 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 I kind of want to play with the Switch so I can see my hands just completely engulf the controller. They just get absorbed into your skin once you Probably, put them in there. Yeah. <laughs> the worst thing an HR manager could wear? A shitty diaper or your clothes? <laughs> wow. What's the difference? Am I right? <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh yeah. yeah, that's very uncalled for. <laughs> 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 nice self roast there, man. Wait. Segment three commentary here. On the <laughs> A phrase nobody in the history of mankind has ever uttered. Wow, Malf, great quiplash answer. Or, <laughs> lend me, daddy, lend me again. <laughs> God damn it. That's, that's, Ryan. so, that's Ryan's answer 100%. It's 100 percent the winning answer. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so sorry, blend me, daddy. But this is this is Ryan's just all <laughs> roasting each other so hard. Oh. That's oh, oh my man. god. It did Poor get Ralph. a quiplash, yeah. Oh. I was sure it was gonna be a roast one way or the other, like I was sure someone was gonna be like nice hair and L or something like that, you know? Yeah. I don't think I've ever yeah. seen Malf win a round of quick <laughs> <laughs> but i believe you're correct up up. <laughs> klc kentucky loud country khaleesi <laughs> likes chicks kate loves c star 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 kryptonite wow. laced chicken kentucky wow. licked chicken craft light cheese that might just say kate loves cats it, it is cats <laughs> <laughs> yeah is it I don't know. It depends. You know, this is the next level of comedy where you let the audience think of 
what it the is. The joke. Nice. Yeah. They're yeah. the dirty ones. You let them make the joke. Hey, 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 what are you gonna do? Oh, chill. Smell fucking one. <laughs> I don't think nice. most ever won the uh, group Right before. after we said it, that's <laughs> so the first time for everything. That's <laughs> <laughs> hilarious. Oh, he's been practicing. The last thing you want to find in a vacuum bag. Your missing cat from your childhood or a fat cum rag? The fat cum, cum rag is my rap name. Victorious. <laughs> 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 oh, did you have to fight your mother for it? <laughs> oh man, this is some highbrow humor. This is a great show. <laughs> the worst thing to paint on a new baby's nursery wall. Still images from the 1997 movie Spawn, or a life-size likeness of Kim Jong-un. Yo, somebody stole a very northern liony answer here. Oh yeah, that's someone not you. Is, okay, someone that's, is yeah. pretending to be me, and it's yeah. Malf. Dude, yeah. he he got me because I voted against that based on the fact that I asked <laughs> who it was yours. I I take a like a great respect for that. Thank you, Bear. When on the subway, it's polite to give up your seat to get a free yoga bread sarmi or to give up your seat to yourself from the future. Uh, when on the subway, I get it. Because uh, their bread had the chemical that was also in yoga mats. Gotcha. That's too uh, cerebral for us. <laughs> the worst thing to write in the tip section of a check. No tip, you need Jesus, or how do you like them apples? No, it's That'd damn be apples. very rude. Sorry, damn. Damn. How do you damn like apples. them apples? Shouldn't what you, you shouldn't say apples. as you're getting baptized. It's Just on. keep me under or no tip, I need Jesus. <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> nice, nice. That's an investment from a previous answer. That's yeah, impressive. Yeah, yeah. Both are great answers. A road sign that would cause you to turn around. Watch out for the old lady you just hit or watch out for NLSS meme section. Oh, that's this. Watch out. <laughs> this is actually like the whole show, almost. I like that the was... new NLSS meta where we just discuss what's gone on in the current show. Well, I see it like, like the NLSS <laughs> is like, recap. the NLSS is like whitewater rafting. You're either like moving the water forward to propel the show, or you're trying to steer in an absurd direction and like keep like the, the direction going in a sensible place. Instead, it was like, you know, someone was trying to keep the water going, and then everybody else just jumped in and said, Hey, you stupid water! Your water is stupid! What if your water was like this instead? And then, it's pretty much Why how this whole... Why isn't it pudding? Is. Hey, you know what's cool about water? I mean, what if water was pudding instead? Or what if you had a little glass of water that was made out of lightning they bolts? Made a movie. <laughs> hello, water. And <laughs> hello, you stinky water. Where did Hello come from? I don't know. Yeah, Nick. I want to know. Yeah, hello, stinky Nick. Nick. Hello, you stinky Nick. Go play a platform. Yeah, go ugly. play a Metroidvania, ugly. <laughs> I did. I played 40 hours of Hollow Knight. Good. If we were white water rafting, who would be the rudder? What's the rudder? <laughs> I don't think there's a rudder. They don't have a rudder. <laughs> you put somebody on the back. I've, I've been in white water rafting. You've been in white water rafting? Yeah. Tell me about it. How was you put it? somebody on the back, you got like everybody on the sides of the Do raft, and you put somebody on the back of the raft, and they're the ones like basically steering the ship. Do they have to like be like big? I mean, so it's generally a good idea to have a, a want, good like, an like, anchor, anchor back weight. There? Why? It's just, it's it's an anchor, you know? It's like it keeps the whole thing centered. <laughs> you don't want an anchor in your boat when you're moving. <laughs> you don't use you know, an anchor in a white water. is not literally to be an anchor. It's just like, you know. So they're not really a rudder, and they're not really an anchor. Well, they're a person. Okay. Are they a tangerine? Hello, you I'm anchor! Gonna... I've been, like, twice. I'm not an expert on the damn subject. But... That makes you an expert, as far as I'm concerned. Did a place of work take you on a team building exercise? Nah, it was we we had a group of friends. We went every year. It was like a little annual trip to Wyoming that you did, you did twice. Yeah, I'm just I'm, <laughs> I'm not a very good friend. <laughs> <laughs> I was there like three or four times, but I've only gone actually rafting like. Twice. Okay, I see. You know, I'm just trying to find the inconsistencies in the story. See, right now I'm being the water, and you're steering. <laughs> And I'm Here's trying. The I'm throwing some like some choppy waves in your way, and you gotta navigate the slalom. 
judo chop. You, you got a six so seconds. So if I by just the start way. shouting obscenities while you're making jokes, I'd be the rocks. No, you would actually just be like, I don't know, Let's the business putting guy. us out of business, basically. Yeah, you'd, you'd be the guy who's, you'd be the guy who's like, I can flip over the boat and fuck everybody. Silver and bronze medal. Mathis? <laughs> yeah, exactly. You would be mad. <laughs> See, that time you, you navigated the rocks, man. The nickname Van Gogh gave his remaining ear, Neo. With, but it's spelled like Van Gogh. <laughs> right. It's boring. Or speaker box. <laughs> This is me versus Dan. No, it's me versus Sinvicta. I was at least half right. But why does he call it Neo? It's the only one. Oh! It's the, oh! 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 Super meta. A warning that should come it. with every IKEA futon. Don't breathe this, or warning, you just bought a futon. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Why oh no! That? Wins. <laughs> There's no exclamation no point though. It just ends. The concern just ends right there. It's just oh no. Well, you pay by the letter at the printing company. Ah, okay. Ah, this is extremely offensive, but is it cause for retribution or is it just funny offensive? Mm, that's incredible. Go for it, man. You know, chat's gonna egg you on for it. Oh, I, I don't it. know. Like, it's pretty anti Semitic. I mean, if you gotta say that, I think you know the answer already. <laughs> Is it like pretty anti-Semitic or? No, it's anti-Semitic. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm sure Chad will forgive you, right? They're they're a forgiving bunch. Shoes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Did you do it? Yes. <laughs> okay, he did. The name of a holiday you quickly make up to get out of work. YouTube Appreciation Day or Rosh Hashanah? Well, apropos of nothing at all, it seems like we got a message from Mathis Games here. Well, dude, a lot of people think I'm Jewish because I have a big nose, but I'm not. Jewish. Wow, that's just out of nowhere on that one. The three. And it might be a wooden lifeboat. In a drink called the Chicago. Inferior pizza, poor housing, and gun crime, or Robert Lamb, Jason Chef, and Lou Lognane? I have no Lee? idea. How did you turn Lee what? into Lou? I don't know, because I don't know any of these fucking names to begin with. <laughs> Austin, what is that? Is that a safety quip? Those are the band members of Chicago. Oh god, it got, ah. th it got thrashed so hard. <laughs> It's like 90, 90 to 10. Way too deep. That's so clever, but it, it's I, too it clever. deeper than a deep dish pizza. <laughs> I, mean, I, I got it, Austin. Apparently, I was the only one who got it. The worst thing to say is you enter a tough biker bar. Motorcycles suck. Cars are better. Or, very annoying voice. Mind if I roll need? One is a, is a water boy joke, and then... <laughs> I say we let him go! <laughs> wow! What? Mind if I roll need? 82 to 18? Mm, wow. I thought maybe like 60 40, but <laughs> come on! The best way to make a waiter at a snooty restaurant angry is to keep asking for him to suck your dirty, filthy cock or asking, where's the goods? while winking aggressively. <laughs> wow, winking. Yeah, that's one word. Yeah, that, yep. is, one, that is Frank Underwood saying that. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the goods, Clay? Wow, Money aggressively. Is million dollar McMansion that falls I'll apart in ten to years. How is <laughs> the <laughs> that lasts for the <laughs> years? Yelling fire in a crowded movie theater okay, is bad, but even worse is yelling reported. <laughs> <laughs> but deported! even worse is yelling deported! during a funeral. Deported. <laughs> <laughs> Topical. <laughs> Current events. Hey, uh, hey, uh, Rob, what's your favorite movie? The Departed. Hey, what did Austin do in that uh, Battlegrounds episode where Mouth got drunk? He sharted! 
I was just tipsy. I wasn't drunk. <laughs> a mystery that Nancy Drew couldn't solve. The case of the MISS ISSI PPI or the case of the mysteriously deleted emails. <laughs> Man, we're going real topical today. Hey, uh, hey, what's the what's the opposite of ended? Started. Started. Yeah, started. What's gonna happen if we keep doing this meme? I'm gonna be evicted. Wow, that didn't even remotely rhyme. <laughs> nah, that was pretty far off. <laughs> <laughs> a name for a lingerie store targeted to very conservative women. Victoria's Secret emails, or for your eyes only. <laughs> <laughs> I like that one. Classi That's Victoria's Classifieds. Blue Man! Oh God! Something yeah, you should no, never you say when pulled over by a small town sheriff. Drop your mom's <laughs> panties or you're a lot taller than that last <laughs> cop. That? He's a small town sheriff. Oh! 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 Bert Reynolds' mustache would say if it could talk. I'm sentient for the love of God, don't shave, or. Is mouth here? <laughs> Only a hero, a hero could shave us. <laughs> That's a good answer. <laughs> it wasn't mouth. It was me. Oh, he talked up his own problem. If you've been baited by the rules, make sure to use your Twitch Prime subscription. A shocking thing to see digging through your garbage at night. Rob or Lion Robert? <laughs> <laughs> Go fuck yourself. Somebody ban that man. <laughs> extremely rude. If you think you should ban that guy, make sure to use your Twitch Prime subscriptions. <laughs> oh, man. The advice a couple's therapists would give to Captain America and Bucky. Have you tried yoga or nothing? Only a hero could save them. Nice. 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 Yeah. Nice. Quality nice. reference. Nice. 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 Got one. Nice. Got one. <laughs> got one nice. He's done it. Nice got one nice. See nice. done? <laughs> what the fuck is happening in this show? I thought this it was been a good I feel operating on eggs I'm switched on. I feel like <laughs> our timing has been like <laughs> nailed. Let's see who's winning. Mm -hmm. now. A <laughs> cheesy pickup line from a camel. Would you like to and then the camel snickers suck my dick? <laughs> or I'll take you on a Gouda date. What? That's what? Amazing. What? That's gotta be a oh, it's cheesy. It's cheesy. Oh. Oh. When buying a new home, always make sure the previous owner didn't stink it up. Am I right? Or bury a bunch of Native Native Americans wow. under it. Wow. <laughs> The Native the Americans call that a burial the ground. Stop. What the S stands for in Ulysses S. Grant? Slide me another brewski or suck? Mm. Ulysses yeah. suck. Yeah, that, that sounds right. <laughs> I do want to point out that the left answer is pretty good because he died of cirrhosis. Don't. How do you know that? <laughs> you know, Ulysses S. Grant was a notorious imbiber. Yeah, and Kepler had a fucking elk that he kept upstairs and he drank too much beer from the punch bowl and fell down the stairs and broke his neck. Who gives a shit? <laughs> How is there not a rapper named Notorious and Biber yet? Just... A mm -hmm. good way to get kicked out of a jazz band. My favorite jazz man? Ed Dials Mavis. Or playing oboe because it ain't a jazz instrument. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> this Styles Mavis. Right, this no, could be okay. anybody. <laughs> I, think I, I think I know who the first one is, and I think I know who the second one is. <laughs> uh, uh, orchestra oh, jokes. Obo wins. <laughs> a bad thing for a TV meteorologist to say during a tornado warning. Quickly oh. go hide under an overpass or the <laughs> N-word. 
Yeah. <laughs> 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 okay. Probably true. No, that would be really bad. Yeah. Oh, oh, no. That would be pretty bad. That would be awful. Well. <laughs> that would be very bad. Part of Quiplash oh. is going to the line. <laughs> seeing oh, how Chad. far it'll go. Oh, Chad, I can't wait. I can't wait to see how wrong you are. Well, Bears answer one. 80 <laughs> 20. Yeah, fuck you, Austin. <laughs> oh, man. A bad way to start your valedictorian speech would be Ladies and gentlemen, I did it all for the nookie, or Ladies and gentlemen, I love goats eating coins. Yeah, yeah, all right, so that's Nick, and uh, I'll, I'll give you the vote for that. I agree. All right, I wanted to get Rob at least. Yeah, you definitely got me. I do love goats eating toys. I'm so mad. <laughs> Don't be. You took my quiplash away from me. You eat it. <laughs> 81 to 19. Oh, dude, I wish that this had caps and lowercase, because it's the perfect time to write, This rain tastes funny. <laughs> like that SpongeBob that meme. Me shit. <laughs> oh come on, that was the perfect response. It would have been really good. God actually. damn it. This rain tastes funny. That's Undertale, and it makes me shit. Still did it. Vote for me. Don't be a little bitch, you pansy, or I am the Senate. Okay, so <laughs> this, is, this is the end of today's no. show. <laughs> I'm not gonna vote for any of those, to be honest. Yeah, me neither. Yeah. Pansy no, makes no. sense, because a I'm pansy gonna... is also a kind of flower. I'm gonna oh. click the vote for me. And it's oh. treason. Metals are not so this is how liberty dies. Nicer, so. With thunderous applause. <laughs> Can we share this tweet the exchange they between they Josh and his dad? What's going on there? Alright, so someone made an art of Josh and his dad. Okay, I made one art. An art. And okay. Single Josh's art, dad know. goes, this is awesome, I love it. And then Josh goes, Pops is the coolest guy in any room. Yeah. And then Josh's dad goes, only until Josh walks in and cools it off another five degrees. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> what a kind burn. That's actually <laughs> fucking stupid because... <laughs> like, like, it, it should depend walk. on the size of the room. <laughs> Unless we're saying that, you know, Josh is just five degrees cooler than any room, and if he stays in it for a long enough time, then he's gonna make it the same temperature as himself. Like, it's just completely ignorant of thermodynamics.